President Yoon Suk-yeol held summit talks with Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman during his official state visit to Saudi Arabia. The leaders agreed to a level of their cooperation, from oil-based to future-oriented ties, to transform their respective economies. Our Oh Soo-young starts us off. South Korea and Saudi Arabia agreed to ramp up their bilateral cooperation to a future-oriented strategic partnership in new industries, with over 15 billion US dollars worth of deals to be inked as they prepare for a post-oil economy. President Yoon Suk-yeol and Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman held a summit in Riyadh Sunday, as Yoon becomes the first South Korean leader to make a state visit to Saudi Arabia. Their talks also fall upon the 50th anniversary of South Korean firms entering the kingdom's construction sector. Until now, the bilateral relationship focused largely on one commodity, oil, and construction projects in Saudi Arabia dating back to the 1970s. But now, with the Saudi Vision 2030 looking to diversify away from oil and spark economic and social innovation, the two countries are expanding their cooperation into new promising areas. As investments in nuclear power plants, green energy, digital technologies, and AI expand globally, our partnership with the Middle East region is moving to a stage that encompasses future industries such as hydrogen, IT, automobiles, and renewable energy. Yun said the two countries make optimal partners in growing their post-oil economies, reiterating the need for greater collaboration. He also asked Bin Salman to play a leading role in stabilizing global oil prices amid market volatility. The Crown Prince welcomed the President's state visit and pledged to communicate more frequently with Yun saying Korea is a key partner in this Vision 2030. Agreeing to strengthen cooperation in the defence sector, the two leaders also saw eye-to-eye -eye on the potential for partnership in fields such as tourism, smart farms, statistics, cybersecurity and food and drug regulations. They also called for joint efforts to produce solid outcomes before holding a signing ceremony for key memorandums of understanding. These include a visa exemption scheme for diplomats and state officials, establishing a strategic partnership committee and agreements to cooperate on hydrogen production and utilisation, government statistics and regulatory procedures on food and medical products. The two leaders also welcomed the more than 50 business MOUs to be signed during Yoon's official visit, worth some $15.6 billion of investment, on top of the $29 billion Riyadh pledged to inject into South Korea last year. Also during their talks, Yun and Bin Salman discussed their response to the Israel-Hamas conflict, with the South Korean leader offering necessary support, including humanitarian assistance. Going forward, Yun's office says, with South Korea's developmental experience and technological prowess, and Saudi's abundant resources and growth potential, the two countries can strike up synergy as they shift towards a sustainable future and look to overcome complex geopolitical challenges. Oh Soo-young, Arirang News, Riyadh.